Hello everybody, it's Malakat here, and I saw somebody play this earlier, and saw that it was releasing today, as of the time of recording this video, probably yesterday, or maybe a couple of days ago, as of the time of publication, but I will leave a link down below. This looks really interesting. It's entirely randomly generated, so no two playthroughs are ever going to be the same. It's a different experience every time, supposedly. And it's also done without, like, chases or monsters jumping out at you or traditional jump scares. So I'm really looking forward to this. And I hope you are too. So... Without any more fluff, let's get on with Dolmare. <clears throat> with rent and bills piling up, I took a part-time job in an old toy factory. People whisper about its shady reputation, but I don't care. I just need the money. Today is my first day. I never could have imagined what's waiting for me inside. Okay. The sweet New guys, you're finally here. Welcome to the Sweet Cheeks Factory. Press the green button to enter. Okay. No time to waste. The work is already waiting. But first, All right. go to the locker room and put on your uniform. Locker room. Alright, which one of these is mine? Locked, locked. Oh, that one's a different color. Yay! All right, now hurry up and go to the workshop. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Which way to the workshop? Right there, I guess. Yay! The lights are already on, I suppose. Welcome to your workplace. Get used to seeing it a lot. You Good sound like an asshole. Quality of all the dolls. A doll passes the check. Put it on the conveyor on the right. A doll right. is broken or is missing something. Throw it in the trash. You can find the detailed instructions on the nearby table. Instead of throwing it in the trash, can I take them home to return to my own? I hope you don't fail as miserably as the previous guy. I hope you don't suck as hard as you sound like you do. Okay. I'm trying to get into the light here. Okay, yeah. All your fingers, all your toes. No visible damage. All right. There you go. Yay. You are missing a leg, which is unfortunate. I could fix that, but I'm not allowed to. Is that damage on your clothing? Seems to be a lot of quality oh, issues with this factory to tell you one more thing. Here at the factory, we have some special protocols that must be followed carefully. One of these protocols is to keep all doors closed at all times. But it seems like you already follow this protocol. Good job. I mean... Baby Cat is mobile. I get used to keeping doors closed around the space station so that she can't access the warp drive fuel. 
Have you ever dealt with a kitten that's been drinking warp drive fuel? Not only is it worse than the worst over-sugared toddler you've ever seen, but if it happens to you, I pray your child is potty trained already, because I will never forget those diapers. Anyway. Okay. This one looks to be in good condition. Bye! doll. Cute haircut. Okay. Don't seem to have anything wrong with you. Off you go. That's only mildly disconcerting. Goodbye. Okay. Oh no, I think I already see damage on your clothes. Oh, damn. That's unfortunate. Seems like a fairly run-of-the-mill quality assurance job so far. Okay, I'm getting a fact. Because apparently it's 1987. Uh, under certain conditions, a doll may follow you and ask for a ball. Stay calm and follow the appropriate steps. Find a ball and quietly hand the ball to the doll. After giving the ball, step aside and allow the doll to leave on its own. Do not attempt any other form of communication or action with the doll. If the doll asks for something else or you do not have a ball, notify your supervisor and leave your workplace immediately. Hmm. Okay. I do not know where I would even find a ball. Uh, are you blinking? One second. All body parts, all fingers, no dents. I don't see anything that says anything about movement, but I'm going to assume that that is not a planned feature. Okay, good, I was right. This one just plain doesn't even have a head. What's going on in the factory? Are y'all drinking or smoking back there? Oh, missing an eye. That could have been a cute doll, too.
Okay, so I'm going to pretend that didn't just happen. Good clothes, good fingers, good toes, no dents. That's pretty hair. What the hell? The generator is shut down. Follow the emergency lights downstairs and turn the damn thing back on. What do I look like? Maintenance? I'm quality assurance. I better be getting paid overtime for this. And a doll just committed self-delete in front of me. Wonder. Ma'am? Doors locked. being messed with by a doll. Finally, Finally what, took what took you so long? long? Your mom! Whatever. Your job is done for today. Go home and rest now. Don't think so too is your hard mom. About what she's done for the day. I know she's done for the day because I'm the one that did her. Perfect Fine, day. it's adequate. But don't think I'm impressed. There's always room for improvement. That's not what your mom said. I want a table fan. I just finished my first day at the factory. There's something strange about this place, though I can't quite put my finger on it. At least I got paid. I keep telling myself tomorrow will be better, but deep down, I'm not so sure anymore. Boss was kind of a dick, but it wasn't that bad. Hurry up, new guy. You have a lot of work today. Bite my ass. and grab a bucket. The ceiling in the workshop is leaking a bit. Why am I sorting dolls? The director always knows when I've sorted them wrong, down to the slightest defect. What's the point of me being here? It's a good question.
classy. Okay. I have improved the dolls. Now they have a voice function. So now you have to check if it works as intended. Check the rules for detail. Ah, there's my fan. It's cute. <laughs> No movement has been added to the sign. Okay. And no dents has been removed. Oh, pretty hair. Cute pinafore, too. I hate you. Never mind, you're a bitch. It's wearing the same cute red pinafore. Okay. Hello. Good. Oh, I forgot to mention. From time to time, we get custom requests for special types of dolls. You will find all related instructions and the order itself on the right table. Every completed order significantly increases your paycheck, so don't mess it up. Okay. An event planner orders custom dolls as party favors for a fairy tale themed cel birthday celebration. The dolls will add a touch of enchantment for the young guests. I need one doll dressed in lumberjack clothes. Okay. Does that count as lumberjack clothes? That was very nice. Is it hair messed up or is it supposed to be like that? That was very nice. I'm gonna assume it's supposed to be like that. And I need to go to Filament, right? Just the light. Um, I need a box. Order list is not attached. I'm a dumbass. At least it's not too far.
right. <clears throat> you don't have a head at all. One doll in sleepwear. Okay. Okay, so... I might have a problem fulfilling that request. It seems that the dolls were hungry and ate all the shipping boxes. See if I can get more boxes. Okay, it's not full of dolls anymore. That's comforting, maybe? Question mark. His eyes are blinking, I love you. which is unfortunate. What's wrong again? Mm. The conveyor seems to be stuck. Go to the assembly room further down the corridor and fix it. Again, I am not maintenance, sir. I am quality assurance. You need to get the two straight. Why is this door open? Aren't the rules to always close the doors? It's locked open. Wonderful. So apparently the rules only apply to employees. Fuck you. Okay, I see the problem. Can I jump? Yeah, I can jump. Apparently not over the fucking conveyor belt, though. This is ridiculous.
Hmm? Don't let her catch me. Did you just turn around to look at me? Creepy ass bitch. Clogging the body parts. I'm clogging the body parts. I'm clogging the body parts. Doll bodies, of course. <clears throat> Always doll bodies. Dolls. The room just got way smaller, didn't it? Yep. And that door's closed now. It was locked open before. Okay, what next? <clears throat> that was very nice. Same. Unfortunately, though, that'll get that'll get us both thrown in the garbage. Just hear something odd. You've got to be kidding me. This is what you consider acceptable. What's wrong with that one? Sharp teeth. I didn't even fucking notice. Well, this one's got a dent. Kicked over the bucket because I'm a clumsy bitch. something giggling <laughs> oh motherfucker what was that um hi
Okay. That happened. The director is lying to you. I gathered that. Oh my goodness, I love this one's hair. The blue piggy tails and the little denim pinafore. I have to make a doll with blue piggy tails and the denim pinafore on stream sometime. All right, that's all for today. You can go. Bring the bucket back to the utility room on your way. tomorrow don't come tomorrow okay Go home. Another successful day at the factory. Making cute dolls for the children. Hmm, not bad. For once. But don't push your luck next time. What do you mean for once? Dick. I want to check a lantern. And a cactus. I've made it through another shift. The dolls seem different today. Their eyes. I swear they followed me as I moved across the factory. I keep telling myself it's all in my head. But this place, it's getting to me. I can feel it. Feels like a longer walk than usual. It's probably not, but... New employee. Insert the employee name here. I've got some business to handle elsewhere, so I won't be around the factory today. There's a new task for you. We've got a bunch of dolls that have missing eyes, hands, legs, or heads. Throwing those into trash from now on is prohibited. You'll find all the info you need in the repair room behind you. Don't mess up the director. And go fuck yourself, director. Anyway, in seriousness. Cactus. Cactus. Jack o' lantern. Ok, 
Okay. So there's a repair room behind me. This is the repair room. If a doll is missing body parts, place it on the holding stand and attach the missing limbs. If the doll is missing hair, there is a special tool behind the holding stand. Use it to create new hair. Do not put your head inside it. It is not a hair dryer. Someone tried once and it did not end well. Now get back to work. What? Oh, she's missing a leg and an eye. Okay. I need a leg. That is the wrong leg. That's the right leg. Eyes. I need an eye. Okay. More like mildly concerned at the minute. All right. Good. It's a good thing that it uh, doesn't say anything inappropriate. Otherwise, I would have just wasted my time fixing it. It's raining baby parts. Well, I already know that you're gonna have to go into the disposal. Yeah, 
There we go. We have received a report about an unusual doll with claims that it moves on its own when unobserved. Sweet Cheeks believes that these are simply hallucinations caused by overwork. If you notice any signs of the doll moving when unattended, pack it up and send it to the fulfillment room for further examination. Okay. Why is the disposal open? Don't blink too often. Excuse me? Where it doesn't look like the lights are even on. <laughs> okay. I need a head. I need I Okay, that's a cute doll. Glad I picked the purple eyes because it got blue hair. And that is really cute. That is really cute. <coughs> oh, yeah. I love you. Okay, good. It says an appropriate phrase. I am not entirely sure how that even happens. Can I repair you? I don't think I can. Sorry, I was going to try. <laughs> what the ever-loving hell was that? What <laughs> the fuck? Hello. Where? I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. Behind you. I love you. What? That was very nice. I don't like this. I hate you. I love you. That was very nice. I love you. Sweet cheeks. I love you. I love you. Sweet I love cheeks. you. I hate you. Sweet cheeks. Mm -hmm. 
very nice. I don't like that. I hate you. I love you. There it is. That was very nice. Hi. <laughs> You're creepy. Bye. Oh my god. I ain't even gonna try. No. Okay. You know what? Excuse me. Back. Okay, what was I supposed to do with the doll that moves? Send it to the fulfillment room. Okay. door is locked. If you're reading this, you've been trapped. The fulfillment room door is shut and you can't get out, right? Don't panic. There's a way out. I squeezed into the lift shaft and pressed the dispatch button. It took me to another place from where I found a way back to my workplace. I'm leaving this note in the shaft in case you get stuck too. I hope you manage to escape and figure out what's going on, if I haven't already. 
the worker before you, K. All right, then. I guess I'm getting inside. And that doll was there. I don't like that. Do I have a flashlight or anything? No, I don't have anything. Okay. I'm gonna have to hope for the best here that... Mm -hmm. The game crashed. Huh? The game crashed. Hi there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Editing Mallow here. And I just wanted to say, since the game crashed, and my computer is not enjoying handling the very large video file that I'm working with, I'm going to cut it here. This seems like a good place to pause. And look for part two tomorrow. I enjoyed this game immensely. You are not going to want to miss the ending. Alright, see you then. Bye-bye.